The struggles of the Arizona State volleyball team continued on Friday as they fell to number 17 Stanford. Although this one didn't go to five sets, ASU still proved that they can hang with some of the top teams in the country. The Sun Devils got off to a hot start in the first set, leading for most of the first half until Stanford picked it up and went on a 4-0 run. The Cardinal controlled and dominated the rest of that set, winning 25-17. Stanford at the net, gets it done, and takes the first set. ASU bounced back in the second, ramping up the intensity of their serve to help take that set 25-21. Junior pin hitter Iman Asanovich and sophomore setter Ella Snyder led the team with two aces apiece on the night. Players like Asanovich and junior libero Annika Larson continue to shine even through the string of ASU losses. Asanovich posted her 15th match in a row with double-figure kills, and Annika Larson put up her 10th match of the season with double-figure digs. Both players lead the Pac-12 in those respective stats. Unfortunately for the Sun Devils, they were unable to carry that momentum from the second set into the rest of the match. The third set was the closest of them all, with Stanford winning 25-23, and the Cardinal took the fourth, 25-20. A theme from the match for ASU was allowing Stanford to go on beefy scoring runs, including a 7-0 run from the Cardinal in that fourth set. These unanswered runs are something that the Sun Devils have dealt with for the majority of their matches this year, and is something they will need to fix moving forward. The loss on Friday adds to ASU's four-match losing streak, but they'll have the prime opportunity on Sunday at Cal as they'll face off against the Golden Bears, who are also winless in the conference. Until then, this has been Nick Borgia for Cronkite Sports.